Hey, what's up again? I'm, I was watching my video and doing a little review of it, and I, I wanted to add something on um, to pretty much every video I've ever made. And it's that when you see successful people, I, I don't think a lot of people, I don't think anyone who's, who's not quite there yet realizes that these people have their life set up so their activities support them in their successes. So for example, like this morning I made a video on the beach um, talking about how, how good it feels to be up in the morning and going and you know having stuff that makes you excited to get out of bed. Well there are a lot of things that go into that. One is is your physical strength and your you know just your you know stamina and ability and overall health. Um, two I got up and I jumped in a cold shower like not immediately but like a few minutes after I got up and you know that made me feel really really good. Um, three I'm, I'm used to you know having variable amounts of sleep and I can operate on it because like I've been practicing it for for years and it's just something that I like knowing how to do. I feel like it's crucial to my success if I ever need to do an all-nighter and then pop up early in the morning and like still be able to give it a you know 100% or more. Um, three, I eat really healthy. So yeah, there's just a whole bunch of stuff, a whole bunch of activities. Um, that feed into this and also like I said I, I give myself lots of reasons to get up and out and out of bed in the morning so and it's almost like not even consciously it's just like I just do stuff that I want to do and then that just feeds into itself of me wanting to get out of bed so just a little like peek under the hood at um Sorry, I got distracted by the girl running by. Um, uh, what it what it looks like, what stuff look like looks like on the surface. Oftentimes, it's like the like you re, you ever remember the picture of the iceberg in school or like in class? There's always like some sort of you know. I I remember seeing it a few times. There's a picture of you know an iceberg where you had like the water line. And then, like, the tip was, like, maybe that high out. And then underneath, like, it was, like, the whole, whole bit. And it was, it was, like, 90% underwater and 10% out of water. And I think that's what, like, it said 90%. And it was a success thing, too, funny enough. It was, like, it was, like, success, like, the showing part is only 10% of it. And then 90% of it is, like, all the work that's done um, underneath underneath the surface where no one actually sees and that all has to that all ties into like the habits and the, you know the daily practices of you know what people do uh, in their everyday routine that either supports them in becoming what they are and then like showing a positive percent or doesn't and then like that also shows that is not being so positive. But just think of it like that. Like 90% of what you're going to do in your life is going to be under the surface. So enjoy it. Make it, make it like nourishing for yourself. And, you know, or at least just know it. That's just my point. Like, if you're watching someone that's successful, they're not just that part that you see of them. You're just seeing, like, a tiny little bit. Or even anybody that you see, you're just seeing tiny little, bit, little bits of them. There's a whole behind the scenes that goes into it. And just think about a movie. It's an hour movie. Think about how much, or like an hour and a half, maybe two hours max. Think about how many hours went into that to create that experience for you like just just like what like seriously watch the credits the next time you you watch a movie all the way to the end 
look at how many people went in, not only how many people went into the movie, making that movie, think about how many hours they spent. Think about how many takes and double takes, like, all the actors had to do. Or if there was, like, a big scene, like, how many people were included in it and everything. Yeah. A little food for that. Alright. Thank you very much. <laughs> Have a good day.